What is going on everybody and welcome back to another episode of our Pokemon Silver randomized Nuzlocke. It has been a while since I have actually sat down and recorded one of these. I pre-recorded for the most part up until like yesterday uh, for like five episodes or something like that. So it's been like a week since I've actually played this game. So we are going to do a party recap and we are going to be jumping in to finish off Team Rocket and then hopefully we'll see about time, uh, but we might be able to take on the gym as well. So. Before we do anything, let's take a quick peek at our team. We have got, starting us off, we have got Martiz. Still trying to level up Martiz so we can get him to evolve, of course. Holding that focus spam with Teleport, Confusion, Recover, and Psybeam. We have got Daryl, our Hitmonlee with the Polka Dot Bow, powering up that strength with also Low Kick, High Jump Kick, and Reversal. We have got Varen, our Fur Alligator with Scratch Cut, Bite, and Water Gun. Not an amazing moveset, to be honest, but overall a very nice type coverage for us. We've got Origins holding that scope lens. Oh, I love this. With Pursuit, False Swipe, E-Speed, and Metal Claw. Absolutely love Origins. Super stoked to have that on the team. We've got Powerhouse holding that Amulet Coin with Gust, Powder, Snow, Fly, and Surf. And then we have Lover, our Magneton, with Tackle, Thunder Shock, Thunder Wave, and Sonic Boom. So we've got a pretty solid team under us. I'm still looking to get some uh, evolutions on Martiz, obviously, but we also have some movesets we want to finalize as we go through. Now, we do have to take on Team Rocket today. We got to finish up that before we can do anything else. So let's go ahead and do it, guys. It's an early morning recording. This episode is going up today. I got coffee going. I'm in a good place. I'm happy. I am so happy. It's good to be back recording this Pokemon series. I love doing these. It's so much fun. Uh, I know uh, they're slightly out of place on our channel, but you know what? Who cares? It's my channel. Who cares? Mmm. Oh, God, I love good coffee. All right. Uh, yeah, I know that that's not going to do very much, but we got to level up Martiz here, guys. We just have to. Also, future potential series options. Um, I was looking at, you know, obviously, if I, if I kind of keep my consistent chain here, um, we would be doing like a, uh, a ruby or sapphire version or something like that next. I was looking at trying to emulate with Citra, uh, to get the 3DS versions of Oros. So, I actually got that working, uh, which does mean that if we would like, we might be able to do an Oris, uh, playthrough versus just the basic, you know, Ruby or Sapphire, uh, which in my opinion is a lot more fun. Um, so we've got, uh, some really fun potential stuff coming down the line as well for the Pokemon series is series. We've got multiple series of Pokemon games coming on, uh, later on down the line. <laughs> I don't know the best way to phrase that. All right, defeated Ryder Mia. We did it, guys. Go us. We're amazing. We're basically the best. Uh, there's really no doubt, to be brutally honest. Oh, rival battle. Uh, well, didn't I tell you that I was gonna destroy Team Rocket? Tell me, who is the guy in the cape who used Dragon Pokemon? My Pokemon were no match at all. I don't care that I lost. I can beat him by getting stronger Pokemon. That's what he said that bothers me. Our rival, Will, is kind of a douchebag, is the takeaway. The door is closed. Yeah. All right. Is this actually Giovanni? Or no, this is... This isn't, right? I feel like this isn't. Maybe I'm wrong. All right. Anyway. No, it is. Okay. Well, guys, I hope that you all had a fantastic weekend. Uh, I let... Uh, all right, I was out in Charleston. I kind of mentioned that to uh, you guys in some previous episodes and I had a really fantastic time. Caitlin and I both did. We got to see a friend of ours, stay with a friend of ours, um, and really just enjoy some, some fun uh, beach time, some fun downtown areas and stuff like that. It was, it was really just a lovely, lovely weekend. Uh, we really had a great time. Um, we did watch Frozen 2 uh, for like the 50th time. Uh, because Caitlin and I, that's like our go-to movie to just throw on in the background. I, I don't know why, but we both like the movie, and it's just on in the background like all the time at our house. So, uh, Leah is our friend that we stayed with, and she hadn't watched it yet. Uh, and so we were like, well, you gotta at least see it. Um, you don't have to love it, but you gotta see it. And so, uh, we, we watched Frozen 2 with her, and it was great. It was a fun time. Ah, um... 
so yeah, it was a good time. We had a fantastic weekend. Happy to be back, obviously. It's great to be uh, recording again uh, because I didn't get to all weekend. Uh, not that I normally do over the weekend, but like Friday I didn't record either. Like I didn't do any recording for like three or four days because I pre-recorded like everything. Uh, which is good because it's easy to pre-record these, but like at the same time I kind of missed, uh, you know, sitting down and I like to do my morning routine now, which is just to sit down, record a couple episodes of this, and then be kind of good to go for for a couple days, which is kind of nice, <laughs> to be honest. Um, I do kind of want to talk about gameplay in terms of magic, though, because we've obviously... I've been focusing on getting this series up basically every day, and I hadn't stressed as much about magic gameplay. I do want to get that gameplay up more often, though. Uh, I'd like to have that be in at least every day during the week as well. Um, especially given that we are a magic channel, that makes more sense. Um, hey, we beat Giovanni. Go us. We suck less. Um, but, uh, last week was just because it was kind of a busy week. I didn't really stress about it. Um, hail Giovanni. Lovely. Um, so, um, I was kind of not, like, letting it go for a while, but I just was kind of being easy for a little bit. Oh, TM22. Uh, so we did have gameplay yesterday. We do plan on having gameplay most days this week, if not all days. Uh, so just as a heads up there. Um, vital throw. Wow. Uh, don't really need that on anything, to be brutally honest, but it is a pretty cool move. <laughs> Alright, we beat Giovanni. Now it's time to go bust some heads with the electrodes. Um, I think, also, uh, we need to... Where do we go? I don't even know where we go, I'll be honest. We're, we're, we're just kind of chilling and going around and doing some stuff. Um, I think... Let's try something really quick, because... I honestly have no idea where to go. Is it here? There we go. We did it. All right. We do, we're gonna take one of these electrodes as a static encounter. Um, so the rest will not be, but we will have one of them as a static. So I do wanna get Patreon pulled up because naturally, I forgot. <laughs> All right. Um, I also really do wanna make a soul link happen. Um, I know, so for those of you who are asking, we did try, uh, but unfortunately the person we were planning to do it with kind of backed out. Didn't even really back out, they kind of just didn't respond after a while. Uh, which is kind of sucky because we actually, like, set in stone some plans and then didn't hear anything. Kind of sucks, but, uh, regardless, we're here, and hopefully, hopefully, uh, we can get a soul link going, even if it's just with, like, Will. Um, I think that would be really fun. Alright. Uh, bye. Get it out of here. Um, so we'll see. Hopefully that- We've, like, talked about doing one for fun, just the two of us anyway. Um, and part of me is like, well, it'd be really fun to record that and, like, throw that up for you guys, because I think soul links are just absolutely hilarious to watch. They're so silly. Um, a Kingdra. Yeah, I will switch. Um, we're gonna get Martiz out here. Again, trying to get that Alakazam. I don't know if we get it this episode or not, but I'd love to. Mm. Alright. Uh, we also kind of want to finish out uh, Cadaver's moveset here, or Martiz's, excuse me. Um, we got a little ways to go here, but we're getting there. Uh, Sidebeam does a good bit, but having Psychic on there is just like absolutely clutch. Kind of want to get a variety of moves, though. We don't I mean, TMs are randomized, so I have no clue what we are going to get throughout the game, but it'd be awesome if we could get some uh, slightly better uh, TMs for Martiz as well. Just different typing. Just get some different moves on there, like a dark type move or something like that. It'd be super helpful. Um, look at that, one shot and I like it. Nice job, Martiz. Writer Thomas. That does not look like a Thomas to me. I'll be honest. Alright, still no evol evolution. That's okay. Everything's fine. I'm not reading things because I don't do voices very well. Alright, uh... Lance is telling us how to do our job. I don't really like that, to be honest. Alright. Uh, excuse me. Coffee makes me burp, apparently. Alright. We did it. Now let's go... 
fight these electrode. Uh, let's put lever out front uh, for the obvious paralyzation option. Uh, and let's see what we can get. All right, guys, this is our first encounter. I'm, again, treating this as only our only static in this little area. And it's a Skarmory, which is actually a pretty cool Pokemon. Not worth, like, replacing on our team, for sure. We've got um, a much better team than that. <laughs> but uh, it is actually a pretty cool Pokemon, so that's awesome. <laughs> Obviously new in this gen, too, which is kind of chill. Um, who, if anyone, if we can catch this... Oh, that's an interesting name. Yeah, I like that. Uh, I'm just gonna Sonic Boom this thing a good bit. Uh, it really can't touch us, so... Do we think we can get one more Sonic Boom? I think we actually might be able to. Well, unless we hit it, or don't hit it, twice in a row. Oh my gosh, Lever. Three in a row. How did we not hit three in a row? <laughs> I think we can get one more in, if not... Okay, yeah, there we go. Awesome. Uh, so, with that, let's try and catch this thing, guys. Let's get a new encounter in this episode. Uh, hopefully. Fingers crossed. There it is. Alright, cool. That wasn't too bad at all. We got a new Skarmory for the team, guys. Let's name this thing after Robert Nieder. Nieder, thank you so much. Uh, we're gonna go with Nieder as the name. Uh, Robert, thank you, my friend. I really do appreciate it. Guys, if you are interested in, uh, being named after, whoops, after a Pokemon in this game or in this playthrough, uh, the way to do that is via our Patreon. So, if you sign up there, you are eligible to be a Pokemon in our playthrough. Uh, now, let's swap Martiz back out front. Martiz is way higher leveled than literally everything else, but you know what? It's fine. We need a big red button because we are getting behind in levels a little bit. Oh! I kind of would have rather had the Politoed. <laughs> uh, dude, Politoed is sick. Honestly, Politoed is killer. Technically, we could t try and like catch all of these as static encounters, but I don't know. I don't really love that idea. Okay, that's fine. Uh, I don't really love that idea. I feel like that's kind of abusing the static encounter thing. Maybe I'm wrong. Let me know in the comment section what you guys think. Regardless, we're not going to catch these, so sad day. Um, I could have, well, no. I could have said maybe no to the Skarmory and then tried to catch another one, like this Larvitar. Holy crap, that would have been way cooler. Uh, that would be a swap out, honestly. Like, if we had gotten Daryl swapped out for a Larvitar, I kind of think that's worth it. <laughs> um, Larvitar is absolutely killer um, when it turns into a T-Tar, obviously. All right, guys, but that's it. We finally took down the Lake of Rage Team Rocket headquarters. I love it. And we got HM6. Uh, is this Fly? I believe that's Fly. Oh, no, it's Whirlpool. Okay, well, we will need that later, but for right now, we don't. Um, Lance is giving us a speech. Great. That's fine. We don't need it. All right, cool. Well done. We did it. We did it, we did it. Team Rocket is gone, guys. We are amazing, we're the best. We're basically a Pokemon master at this point, right? Like, there's there's really no contest. Uh, that's it. And guys, we're gonna go straight into the gym. We're only 14 minutes in, I think we can do it. I'm a little nervous. <laughs> um, I honestly don't remember this gym very well. I'm very worried about levels, but you know what? We're gonna try. We're gonna try it, guys. I believe in us, I think we can do it. Uh, and if not, we'll sack off Daryl. <laughs> oh no, this is the stupid ice gym. Alright, well, we're gonna have to fi- I don't remember because it's been so long how to do this- this stupid ice puzzle, but we'll get there. Oddish. Okay, well, that's helpful. Oh, it's only level 26. Why did I think this was gonna be a lot tougher? Well, okay, but see, the thing is, the last gym leader had like a level 40. Granted, we're not at the gym leader yet, but still, like, that seems kind of odd. Uh, a Blissey. Okay, we'll swap it to Daryl. We will try and spread out some XP. I'm still gonna lead with Martiz, um, but we do need to spread out this XP and get everybody else leveled up too, because we have been overusing, uh, certainly overusing Martiz a little bit. That goes so slowly. Alright, but we did it. <laughs> That thing has so much HP. 1500 XP. That's amazing. 
Oh, and a hip now. Okay, uh, Varen. We can bite this thing. Would love to get Crunch on Varen. Uh, I think Crunch is in this gym, I'm pretty sure. Uh, and that would be just a nice, clean upgrade to bite. Um, but regardless, I mean, it's just nice to have that type coverage, honestly. <laughs> the flinch is nice, too. Not gonna lie. Uh, what other dark moves are there in this one? <laughs> I keep thinking, like, Dark Pulse would be great to get on Martiz, and I'm like, wait, that's not even a, that's not even a move yet. <laughs> um, but that's fine. All right. First trainer, down. All right, it looks like we're actually okay on the levels then, because, I, I mean, at least like for these trainers, it seems like we're kind of on par. Um, I'm glad we didn't train, to be honest. That would have been kind of terrible. A dugong. What level are you? 31. Yeah, I mean, we're pretty well set up then. Um, I'm gonna side beam this. It should do a decent chunk. Eh? Not as much as I would have hoped. I thought we could have gotten at least half. Um, it got close, but it didn't quite get there. I don't think Dugong can one-shot us, though. And we do have the focus band, so I think we're okay. Ooh, okay. That did a good bit, though. Um, Alright, get this thing out of here. Dugong down. We did it. Go us. Alright. Trainer Mallory. Um, okay, so we got those two guys down. Let's fight this dude. Let's do this, guys. I believe in us. I think we can get through this gym no problem. Um, famous last words. <laughs> uh, Alright, Moltres. Very, very good. Probably not staying in against Moltres. We need to get Varen out here. We can water gun this thing. Water gun... I think my problem with Varen is just the moveset, right? Like... Water Gun just seems so lackluster in comparison to, like, even just Bubble Beam or something like that, where it's, like, a little more power behind it. Um, also, I know I've said this before, but the sprite for Moltres in this game is so sick. Like, look how freaking majestic that is. I love it. I need to get coffee in between episodes, guys. I'm out. Sad day. Alright. Boom. Almost there. Alright, come on. It does outspeed us, which is kind of interesting. I mean, it is a Moltres, I guess, to be fair. <laughs> uh, fair, yeah, it is a Moltres. Alright, <laughs> let's, uh... Martez leveling up to level 37. Look at that. Baron getting some XP as well. Elkid! Uh, what do we want to do here? Um... I'm gonna go into Origins. Look how bright... Yeah, like, that is a bright yellow sprite. And that is a very shiny sprite. Alright, let's, uh, let's just Metal Claw this thing. Hopefully this, I don't think this can paralyze. Maybe it can. <laughs> Boom. Why I'm smart. Alright. Well, I meant to go up and hit E speed. I didn't do that. So here we are. This is not going to kill, most likely. Um, but you know what? It's fine. Oh, it is. All right. Well, never mind. I think we'll go heal up really quick, too. Uh, just to get us back in, uh, contention. Oh! Yes! Guys, it's happening! Oh my god! The team is complete! Freaking yes! Oh my gosh, I am so stoked. Look at Martiz, everybody! Martiz is here! All right, let's just see really quickly what these stats are on Martiz. Oh, so good, so good. Look at that special attack. Oh my gosh, 118. Wow, Daryl sucks in comparison. All right, uh, <laughs> wow. Holy crap, guys. All right, well, that's just amazing. Martiz is here. I need to like timestamp and remember to actually update the layout. If I don't update the layout, somebody tell me in the comment section. Um, Oh, we got Alakazam. Oh, I'm so stoked. Okay, um, well, that's just really exciting. We need to swap out, though, because we do need to train some stuff up here. Like, for sure. Let's get Daryl out. Daryl's not even level 30 yet. <laughs> like, let's, uh, let's get, let's get Daryl there. Oh, guys, I am so stoked. There's so many trainers in here. Holy crap. All right. 
Guys, what an episode. We beat Team, team Rocket. We're hopefully going to take down this gym as well. All right, uh, we're swapping. We're swapping. This thing has Thrash. I'm not willing to take that risk. Uh, and Lover should be able to just, like, mollywop this thing. Thrash does nothing. Uh, it does more than I'd want. Uh, definitely more than I'd want. Uh, but we are four times effective. Should do a decent chunk, if not one shot. There we go. There we go. Oh, love it. Lover getting a level as well. Very, very good. Dude, that was... This is a sick episode. Oh, what an episode to come back on. So freaking fun. All right. Go us, right? We're we're amazing. All right. Uh, <laughs> what you got? A manky. All right, well, we can definitely take a manky. Uh, I'm actually just going to strength. We have the, the polka dot bow or whatever it is to power it up. Easy. That crit. All right. Daryl, coming in clutch. All right, there's Gyarados again. Let's swap back out to Lover. Interesting that, like, the Pokemon swaps after the other Pokemon has come out. That's kind of odd. Uh, I feel like that's not how it is in the newer games. I feel like you swap your Pokemon first. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know, but it seems like that would be the case. Um, I don't know. Just interesting. All right, one more Pokemon left, and it is a Fortress. Okay, uh... I really hate Fortress, um, <laughs> like a lot. I can't go into, let's go to Origins. I think Martiz could one-shot this, like no problem. It's level 26, we're level 37, but I don't want to risk the uh, the terribleness that is a self-destruct. <laughs> um, so we're just gonna Metal Claw, which does very little. All right, there's the self-destruct. Should do a decent chunk, but shouldn't kill. Um, yeah. Cool. Easy. And I think Artisan Bob. Um, I think it's just the gym leader left, right? Yeah. So, Alright, so we gotta work backwards here. I don't remember how to do this at all. This is just gonna take us back, isn't it? Oh no. Guys, I don't remember how to do this puzzle. I'm a terrible person. Uh, I mean, I can get back here, but that doesn't really help us, does it? This takes us further away. Ugh, I don't remember. Um, if I speed this up, don't be mad. Uh, <laughs> we will find out how to get there, but I don't remember. We did it! Alright, I had to speed that up because uh, I suck and can't remember how to do things. I also maybe looked up a walkthrough, but guys, we're here. Alright, let's do this. Let's take on the gym leader and let's finish off this episode strong, guys. We are doing really well so far. This has been a very productive episode and a great way to come back to the series as well. Look how kind of bad eh, he looks. Uh, Sailor Florentino kind of fits. Look at that shirt. That's a sailor to me. Oh, Porygon 2. Oh, I love Porygon 2. Uh, Daryl should be able to, like, annihilate this thing. Do we try for the high jump kick? I don't think so. Um. Alright. Yes. Uh, absolutely. Holy crap, that was great. Daryl, kicking off strong. Getting a ton of XP as well. Um. I love that. Uh. The thing is with Daryl, I think we're, like, running out of moveset for Daryl. <laughs> I don't know that he really gets there very much at this point. Uh, what do we do against a Raikou? I want to, I want to do it. Look at Raikou. His little beard, he looks like a, uh, this is a mistake. We shouldn't be out here, but let's try it. He looks like one of those old school, like, president photos. You know what I'm talking about? Okay. He's gonna have bite, isn't he? He's gonna have bite. We need to not be in here right now. Um, <laughs> but the thing is, nah, dude, we're trying it. 
We're trying it. We're faster, so if he does use bite now, we just win. Oh, and the confusion. Okay. Side beam. Yes. Okay, so he's going for a quick attack. But he hurt himself. Martiz, you never didn't have it, my friend. Oh, so good. Smeargle. <laughs> All right. Daryl, come on out, my man. <laughs> what a silly Pokemon. This is the ace, to be fair. We're just gonna low kick. It's gonna sketch low kick. Unless it flinches or just dies. Even better. All right, guys, that's a gym leader down. We got our next badge. We beat him, Team Rocket. We got a brand new encounter. And we got Alakazam out of the deal. Glacier badge is here. Updating layout. All right. Guys, we are amazing. We're the best. TM16. Let's see what this is, guys. Hopefully, it's something really good. Bubble Beam. Ooh. All right. So, that could be very helpful if we can teach it to anybody. Let's see. Uh, Varen, maybe? Nope. <laughs> Not Varen. We can teach it to Martiz, uh, which is interesting. And Origins, which makes absolutely no sense. Uh, all right. Well... We'll see. Oh, man. Why, why is this difficult? All right, there we go. We're going to go heal up, guys, and we are going to end this episode after Professor Elm calls us. Oh, this is the radio thing. All right. So what we will do is we will go ahead and fly to Goldenrod because that is our next step. So we can go over to Goldenrod. We'll go ahead heal up there. Uh, and be ready to go for the radio tower in the next episode. But guys, thank you so much. I really appreciate you guys watching this series. It's been a fun one. It's a really, really fun game. Hope you guys are enjoying it. Please make sure to tune in tomorrow. We should have another episode, of course. But thank you guys again. I really appreciate it. Love you guys very much. Hope you had a fantastic weekend. It is good to be back recording. I will see you hopefully tomorrow for another episode of our Pokemon Silver Randomized Nuzlocke. See you guys then.